Hi, this is Peter from the DJ Podcast. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to create playlists in Mixvibes Cross DJ3 DJ software. Now, there are a few different ways that you can go ahead and actually create a playlist. And the first is to select any number of songs or samples that are in your track collection. Then right click on those selected songs or samples and then select Add to New Playlist. You'll see that a window pops up that gives you the option of naming the playlist, and by default, it will simply be called Untitled Playlist. We're going to go ahead and call our playlist Our Playlist. Then you can go ahead and click OK at the bottom of this pop up window. Now that we've created our playlist, it will appear in the Playlist section on the left hand side of the track collection. While that is one way to create a playlist, there is a second option. And to do so, you want to go ahead and right click on the Playlist section of the track collection, then go ahead and click Create New Playlist. It's important to note here that when you do it this way, there's no pop-up window that tells you what you can name it. So we're going to have to go ahead and manually rename our playlist. And this would be the same if you want to rename a playlist that you created using the first option. So to rename a playlist, you want to go ahead and right click on the playlist that you want to rename, then select Rename Playlist. And we can call this My Playlist. Simply click Enter and your playlist will be renamed. Then you can go back to your track collection, get some songs or samples, and drag and drop them into the new playlist. If for whatever reason you want to delete a playlist, you can simply right click on the playlist you want to delete, then select Delete Playlist. You'll see that a confirmation window appears, and you can simply click OK to delete the playlist, or cancel if you decide that you don't want to. Now if you have a lot of playlists, you may want to organize them, and to do that, you can use playlist folders. So to create a new playlist folder, you want to go ahead and click on the playlist section of the track collection view. Then you're going to want to select create new folder. Again, just like creating a playlist by right clicking on playlists and then selecting add new playlist, it's not going to give you the option of naming it initially. But of course you can rename this folder by simply right clicking on the folder then selecting rename folder. We'll just call this our folder press enter to select that name. But of course this folder doesn't actually have any playlists in it. So we need to go ahead and drag and drop our playlist into the folder. You'll see that there's a little box around that particular folder that we're dragging into. So we'll just release our mouse. And now that playlist we created is in our new folder called our folder. The process of deleting a folder is very similar to that of deleting a playlist. So to delete a folder, you want to go ahead and right click on the folder that you would like to delete, then select delete folder. Again, a confirmation window will appear, which is great because it means that you won't accidentally delete a folder that you didn't want to delete in the first place. So we're going to go ahead and click OK to delete that folder. I'm not sure if you noticed, but when we deleted the folder, it also deleted the playlist that was inside that folder. So be careful when you are deleting folders, as there may be playlists in those particular folders that you don't want to delete. Now that you have a basic understanding of how to create playlists and playlist folders, you can separate your track collection into particular playlists based on genre, mood, or BPM. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you would like to learn more about Cross DJ 3 for Mixed Vibes and other DJ software applications, Subscribe to this channel and visit us online at thedjpodcast.com. Thanks for watching.